<coughs> this is Melina Fox, and today we're going to do something a bit special. I have a big problem with you guys. You you have a tendency to call me dirty-minded, pervert, and things like this because I play that game, and I often make weird references <laughs> that are for you maybe sexual, but that aren't for me. You know, I think the problem comes from you guys. But anyway, you you're calling me things, and I was like, I'm going to take that kind of are you perverted test or you know so. These are 23 harmless pictures that prove you have a dirty mind. What I try to do is explain to you how those pictures are anything but sexual. Yeah, and by the way, my hair. So I don't know if you remember that video where I had to punish myself because I loved that Aaron's Don't Love Challenge. And I had orange in my hair and some of you guys were like, you know what, you should try to do your hair, you know, to dye them orange which I did, but because I have a white base, I guess it came out bright, bright pink. It is a bit orange when I have, you know, um, blonde roots over there, but it came out pink. I'm not that mad, but I wanted to be like, guys, I, I made it orange, but it's not. <sighs> Girl's problem, I swear. Okay, so first picture. Well, this one is easy, it's just a girl having her legs crossed and all that shit. By the way, if you have back problems, don't cross your legs. That's, that's the worst thing ever, ever. Oh, and please leave in the comments down below what you think of some of these pictures, because I am sure that you guys are more perverted than I am. Just saying. This delicious Giro, G Giro, Giros, Chiros, also available chicken Giros. Um, I think I just see food. You guys, I'm sure you just see food. This prayer book. Okay, guys. What the fuck is supposed to be dirty in this picture? Please, leave in the comments down below. You have to, you know, teach me. Because I don't see what the... Well, is, is he having fun with himself? I don't, I don't, I don't see anything perverted there. At all. Uh, these candy wrappers. Oh yes, I remember. I think those those candies have been um, removed from some countries because there were sexualized packages. Well, maybe the second one is a little bit, but the first and the third, I mean, not really. I guess. Uh, this convenient shower attachment. Squirting shower. That's for me. A squirt in. And that's not pay, that's squirt. Uh, okay. Oh my goodness, what the fuck is this convenient? It's very convenient. USB power strip. Okay. This one, I must say, looked a bit. You know, but I think these kind of things are flexible so you couldn't use it for other matters so I don't know that, that's just weird some people who invent this kind of thing should really deserve to be hanged I'm just saying for use after a heart slide into second base okay the statue of a brother helping his sister out I mean come on if 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 you're someone who sees something sexual in this then you're sick, because first they are both children, second they're brothers and sisters, and come on, what the actual fuck? I mean, you know what, you deserve to be in jail or um, beaten to death if you see anything sexual in this, I'm just saying. This adorable puppy taking a nap. Hey dudes, if, that, if you think that is sexual or that reminds you of something sexual, you should maybe go to a shop and buy your first razor and make it clean because that's, that's just weird. Uh, why are those pictures so weird? I was already like, the first one could have been, you know, a bit sexual because the girl and thing and whatever. But this one and the brother and sister thing? I mean, what the hell? Really? These teens just being teens. I remember when I saw this the first time, I was like, what the actual fuck is going on there? But honestly, let's be real. The girl with the 
khaki, green khaki thing on the right and the guy there with their eyes. I think they're gonna kill and eat everyone. But except that, maybe that can be sexual in a way. This guy enjoying his vacation. Ah, this one is by far the best one. Honestly, it's the best one. It's for the bombing to an, a whole other level. This one is good. Aaron, is that you there? I mean, is that you there? I don't know, maybe you had a bird? That is weird, I need to make an investigation about that. Dude, having my eyes on you. This company that is advertising the safety of their product. Kid Wood. Feel it, no mess. I can imagine someone being there. Oh, Kid Wood. Wait, I need to try with something else. <laughs> That's just weird. Feel it. I mean, what the hell? That doesn't even look like wood. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's foam. It's written shocking, choking hazard. Kid wood, feel it, no mess, choking. I see what you're doing there. This impressive display of taxidermy. I mean, you know what? I'm always having fun with the fox taxidermy thing meme thingy because it's so funny. But why would you want to make thing like taxidermy is for me something awful? You should not do that, and it's if it's to make shit like that. Well, this one is not that bad. I mean, I I mean, I I think the puma just wants to eat the booty, but it's survival. We all do eat the booty for us to survive. I mean, don't you do that? Don't don't don't, don't you do that? Nah. This face cleansing product. Morning burst in shower facial. Uh, if you haven't seen Trisha Paytas' uh, challenge where she puts a hundred layer of um, a sperm thing, I don't know what, do watch it. It's pretty interesting and it's related to my video, so do watch it. It's, it's You'll learn things. I, I swear you will. This excellent nail salon. A nail. <laughs> Guys, again, if you see anything sexual with this, leave it in the comments down below because a power pool, I mean, what the fuck? And this inspiring Bible quote, whatever your hand finds to do, do it with all your might. Now, honestly, I, I, I think I'm sane because I, there are three or four pictures there that I couldn't see what was sexual about them. I mean, really? You have to be sick to see or in need of some either a little toy or I don't know that, that was just really, I, I'm sorry I just keep touching my hair it's weird I don't like the way it looks but anyway so um, don't forget to just leave in the comments down below your explanation for some of these pictures like the sexual explanation because I in some of them really I don't see what's sexual and I when I took this test I was like I'm pretty I, I, I know I'm a kind of dirty minded and I was like I won't be able to find any explanation for this. I did for some of them, but honestly, some of them aren't at all sexual. So I'm like, kind of disappointed, I guess. And if you have any kind of dirty mind test uh, thingy, just leave it down below and I'll, I'll do them because I just think they're fucking funny. And yeah, um, you can always leave comments, like, subscribe, it always makes the fox happy, they're dying over there. I don't know where to put them. The my the place where I record is fucking shit. Because I have a treadmill here to run, which I never use, but it's there. And right there I have my printer. It means I can't even move when I touch it. So I have no place left to put my fox, so they're just dying over there. I need to start a GoFundMe campaign because I need to have a little space for my fox. Uh, Anyway, I thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!